We are here to witness the blending of the lives of two very special people. Your hearts and your spirits are already intertwined. In fact, those who know you best can attest to your love for one another and the shared hopes and dreams and goals. Catherine Britbess, I take you to be my wife, my life partner, my best friend, and my personal Disney guide. <laughs> it's said that he who finds a wife finds a good thing and obtains favor from God. I, Christopher Heath Hensley, vow to share with you God's plan for our lives together, united in Christ. I vow to always love, protect, and support you till death do us part. When I think of you, I'm reminded of James 1.17, where it says that every good and perfect gift comes from above. I know that you are truly a gift from God, and I vow to always treat you as the princess you are. Catherine, you're such a special human being. You bring so much joy to everyone's life that you touch. I vow to always cherish you and to never take your kind heart for granted. Your love more than any metaphor could ever express. I vow to always love you through sickness and in health, the good times and the not so good times, and even when Frankie destroys our entire house. <laughs> <laughs> I vow to make my life forever yours and to build my dreams around you and our children, Molly Murphy, and of course, Frankie. You are the one in game and my soulmate for today, tomorrow, and the rest of our days. As I once promised your father, I vow to always see that you continue going to church. Ephesians 5.25 says, Husbands, love your wives, wives, just as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her. Catherine, I can't wait to grow old with you, have a family with you, and take care of all the random animals you bring home with you. <laughs> you are the love of my life, and I promise to appreciate, adore, and respect you for as long as we both shall Keith. First of all, I want to thank you. Thank you for showing me patience. Thank you for making me feel valued and loved when I feel I am never enough. But most of all, thank you for choosing me. <laughs> because of you, I stand here today knowing God placed you in my life when I needed you most. I prayed for a husband and two weeks later you showed up on my doorstep for our first date. From that day forward and to our last, I promise to be a place you can come to when you feel the weight of the world or when you feel all the hope is lost. I promise to be here when you have the best news ever and when you feel like you need an extra push to get out of bed. And I promise to love you unconditionally until my last breath. And to your family, I thank you for raising this man I get to call my husband. I promise to always honor and respect him, and I promise to show him love and be by his side in any condition. <laughs> Thank you for giving me this chance to be able to share the rest of my life with you and your family. He Hensley, not only is it an honor, but it is my biggest blessing that I am able to become your wife today. I pray I am able to give you the life that you truly deserve and that God guides us through this next chapter. I love you today, forever, and always. Let all know that from this day forward, we shall recognize them as husband and wife. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. And now you may kiss your bride. joy and honor to introduce to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Heath Hensley. May God bless you as you go.